sleep. Is this bed better? Of course it is. Well, it's been rain overnight. Still a bit damp. But anyway, got to carry on, haven't you? So, what I'm going to do now is just load up, carry on loading up the van. I've got loads more rubbish to put in, but we're going to not take it to the tip today. We're going to go out and have some lunch and do a bit of shopping today. Um... Right, well that's enough on the van. If I take too much in one go, it's just a nightmare down at the tip, so uh, that's enough. That's all I wanted to try and do. I think this week that we were hoping to show you more of the work that we're doing, but unfortunately, with the delayed delivery of flagstones, um, progress on this garden area is a bit short this week. Um, it's due to rain again for most of today. So we have decided to go out. Walking back into the house and something has just caught my eye. Not only are three of the black lilies are now out. Look at that. Look at that vibrant orange. We're in the car and we're ready to go. Where's our first stop? Lunch. Ooh. So we've driven down to Sand, which is one of our local towns, um, quite a busy little town, and uh, off for lunch. And that place over there is where we're headed. It's a nice little restaurant called Le Rive Droite, the right bank. And they've got an outside area or an interior area. Welcome, uh, Senor Butcher. Oui, bonjour, ça va. How are you? Très bien, merci. Uh. Every time we come here, she has the same thing. It's so good. <laughs> do you do red wine? Pourquoi pas? Je vous ramène la carte. Cheers. This is one of my favourite dishes. I have it nearly every time I come, the salmon. And I've got the tartan de gizzard, gizzard tart and a bit of foie gras there. Are you happy? I am, I'm really happy. This is an entrecot. It would be a ribeye 
um, to you and me or in England or wherever you are in the world, I know this is a ribeye. There's only a few places in France where you can get a decent steak and this is one of them. Normally the steak here isn't matured, it's chewy, it's tough, you could whack it against the wall but this is awesome. It's got flavour, it's cooked brilliantly. Love it. And over here I'm having a fish dish. Red wine with fish. Very nice actually. After that wonderful steak, it's now time for dessert. Now, I'm not necessarily a great fan of desserts, but I know somebody who is. But I always get brought a spoon, just in case I would like to share it. And a golden spoon at that, I mean. And a golden spoon. So this is a thing called an assiette gourmand. It's basically a tasting plate of lots of little desserts. Uh, the one thing that really I want... pretty, isn't it? It is really pretty. One thing that I am going to pinch, I'm going to pinch cherry. You can have that. While I'm not keen on dessert desserts, I am however keen on liquid puddings. And I think I'll take after my father with this. I do like the old whiskey here and there. It's a good ratio that, isn't it? Alléluia. À la 200 que Oh. Stuffed. Could do with a long walk now. Where are we going to go in the car? Quick. <laughs> Here I am, it's Mr. Bricolage. So I'm here to see if, firstly, anything to fit this. Now this is one of the cover caps from uh, wine tanks, which um, well, I'm filling with water at the moment as part of the rain recuperation project. Um, I'm trying to work out how to get the water out of there again and don't know. This is one of the covers that goes on the tap. So I need to see if I take this off, what can I fit onto the tap outlet. And they've got all of these things in different sizes, different to pipe work sizes, but hmm, that is bigger than any of them. So I don't think I'm going to find it in here. Next stop. We're at Cash Basine. I'm looking for a cover for here and something for here. Any luck? No, never mind. My turn now, garden centre. But it being the end of the season, there's not a lot left. But I have found this. I'm not sure about where you live, but French garden centres also sell the usual tap that you would probably get anywhere else. But they haven't clocked on to having coffee shops. We are now at one of the highlights of today's activities. We are at the supermarket. Normally, I would shop at Lidl. However, there's things that you can't get at Lidl. That's a supermarket. Hyper Hyper! <laughs> <laughs>
one of the reasons I also come shopping here, apart from you can't get the stuff from little that you can here, is dinner for the fur children. They love that beef steak. So I'll get some for this evening and I'll also get some for the freezer whilst I am here. And some bones as well to keep them entertained. Feeling peckish after lunch, do you want this for dinner? Mm -hmm. Shopping done and it's home time. For a day that was meant to be rainy, it's turning out really nice. just stopped off at a, a little riverside cafe here in a town called Tybor, which is just down the river from the sand. It's got the river. Lovely if you had a boat. After all of that shopping, it looked worse for wear. So I thought I'd better get him a beer and pay for it. Good Wi-Fi app. I'm going to enjoy this. I don't have to try, I'm actually am enjoying it. Well, time is ticking on and I don't think we're going to make it to the Deschetterie today. <sighs> Keldermarsh, as they would say in France. So I better say that. And I'll see you tomorrow.